helical gear. Helical gears remove the disadvantage of bevel gears, and they are called skew gears. In helical gears, the teeth of gears are not parallel to the shaft. Teeth are inclined at some angle, which is less than 50 degrees. Helical gears have more power than spur gears, and they also produce less noise and vibration. And their main function is to reduce speed. Now let's learn about bevel gears. Bevel gear. Bevel gears are used to shift power from one direction to another. If the force is coming to the shaft from X axis, but we need this force in some other direction. Let's say Y direction. Here comes the role of bevel gears. They shift all the force from the X axis towards the required axis. So they help in changing the direction of the moving object. Next, we have worm gear. Here is a screw-like gear drives a big circular gear. And this arrangement is known as worm gear. It reduces speed, but gives more power or force. It can also be used in changing the direction of the motion. Some power source, like a motor, can be used to drive the screw-like gear. Next, we have rack and pinion gear. Here, the rack is a straight bar with teeth on it and other gear mesh with it. It changes the circular motion to linear motion. It is used in cliff and hill climbing and rack railroads, car steering systems, weighing scales, and many more types of machines. So kids, today we learned that there are different types of gears and each type of gear have a different type of function. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and share this video. And if you want to see more fun videos, you can hit that subscribe button. You can also follow us on Facebook and Instagram for more content. Bye-bye.